Our fifth composer was especially helpful with not only the commissioning and composing part of this project, but also the recording process as well. I would love to introduce y'all to Lee Hartman's Vienna Riffs. It turns out that Lee and I actually go back to 2008. When this new thing called Twitter came out, there was a small hive of double read players who all got to where we would send each other messages about random pieces and everything. And he and I had had a few dialogues about new works that I was wanting to play. And he would say, well, why don't you listen to this one also? And so he gave me some really good rep suggestions that actually paid off in the long run. So when I finally met him in 2012 face to face at a concert I was playing, I didn't put two and two together until we had already commissioned him about a month and a half later when the project actually came into fruition. Then leading into him actually providing us with our piece, he would come to our rehearsals every now and then and just kind of check on the piece and see how it was doing. And so much like a plant, he would come in and he would prune it and he would revise it. So it was just, it was exactly like a plant, you know, he would water it and feed it and it would grow. And then he would give us feedback so that we could help it as well. And it was really neat. And it was crazy hard, which was really kind of the fun part of this entire project. Vienna Riffs was especially cool because it was one of the few pieces that we had that was one giant work, and it felt like a symphonic tome poem, but for three instruments, which is really, really hard to do. <laughs> um, but Lee's inspiration for it was from Webern's Seminal Variations for Piano, Opus 27, where Weber had used a certain tone row in there that Lee just fell in love with. But instead of having it have that second Viennese school feel like Schoenberg, Webern, and Berg, he went for more of this Listian opulence with this hyper-romanticism with a capital R. It was fantastic to work on, and I was so happy that we got Lee to work on this because it really helped him, him and I grow this friendship that I value to this very day. So without further ado, here is a chunk of Vienna Riffs. <laughs> 